So while I was looking for a good hack and slash game to play, I discovered a hidden gem that I enjoyed so much and wanted to share with you today. It's called Afro Samurai. The game is based on the anime with the same name and was released on 2009 for PS3 and Xbox 360. It also had a sequel that was removed from PlayStation Network and Steam due to negative reception. So after beating the game, here is my review. The gameplay is pretty satisfying and there's a lot of moves you learn as you level up and combos become more and more devastating. And like any other hack and slash game, timing is very important to perform combos correctly. There is a mod similar to Blade mod in Metal Gear Rising called Focus Mod that slows time down and allows you to slice enemies, evade attacks and even reflect bullets. You can also collect crows scattered in every chapter to unlock special abilities. The soundtrack is pretty good, with cool rap songs during battles, as well as some nice chilling Japanese music. The story is about two sacred headbands that bestow supernatural powers upon whoever possesses them. The owner of the number one headband can only be challenged by the owner of the second one. Hello who can be challenged by everyone. So being the number one, Afro's father was challenged and killed by Justice, it's the number two, you had in front of little Afro. Make your daddy proud. Challenge me when you're ready to duel a god. Thinking about your pops, huh? Which part? The head or the body? <laughs> Years later, Afro became a powerful hey, samurai hey, 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 relax. I'm just with the help of his imaginary friend kind of calls his son and Afro armed samurai. with his father's sword, Name like that, you know his life he decided to avenge his death and recover the headband he once owned. In the end, and despite its short lifespan, Afro samurai is a good hack and slash game that I highly recommend. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more. They call me Keske. You killed my son! That don't help none. He has killed a lot of motherfuckers. Can you be more specific?